let's start walking to the beat of the music while swinging our arms. We're on the Activity Works Farm for today's adventure, where we'll be using a nutrition guide called My Plate to gather healthy food options for our meals. Keep walking. Let's review the types of foods that should be on our plates to have a well-balanced meal. There are five food groups, breads and grains, fruits, vegetables, proteins, and dairy. Let's continue to walk in place over to the wheat field while we balance spinning plates in the air on each of our two pointer fingers to represent how our meals should be balanced. Remember, a combination of foods from each of the five food groups provides energy for the body to grow and for the brain to think clearly. Continue walking while spinning the plates. Now cross your arms in front of your face to make an X and uncross your arms. Try this a few more times while we go over nutrition tips to help you get and stay healthy. Cut back on foods with a lot of salt and sugar. Eat a lot of fruits and vegetables. And most important, be a healthy role model for those around you. You did a great job balancing the plates. Let's jog in place to the beat of the music while we discuss nutritious and delicious vegetables. There are five types of vegetables. Dark green, red and orange, dry beans and peas, starchy, and other vegetables. Keep jogging. You should eat between a cup and a half and two cups of vegetables every day. We've arrived at the green bean plants. Green beans are also known as string beans because they resemble a piece of string. Let's pretend that our string beans are really long, like jump ropes. Put your feet together, grab the rope with your hands, and start jumping rope to the beat of the music while we learn a little more about string beans. String beans are very high in vitamin C, vitamin K, and vitamin A. Very good. Now let's try jumping rope backwards. Your arms will now turn backwards in the opposite direction. Go ahead and try. Let's do five more, but since we're going backwards, we'll count down from five. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Super! Now let's walk in place as we search for more vegetable options. How about broccoli? Broccoli is a great source of potassium, which helps your brain work properly and your muscles grow. Keep walking. It's also high in vitamin C, K, and calcium. It looks like we've entered a giant broccoli forest with all the broccoli plants lined up like trees on both sides of the path. Let's pretend our arms are large scissors and cut down the broccoli so we can eat it. Stop and stand with your feet together. Now step right, step left, step right, lift your left knee, and cut to the right. Good. Now let's start on the left. Ready? Step left, step right, step left, lift your right knee, and cut to the left. Great! Now let's cut down eight more broccoli plants. Ready? Right, left, right, knee up and cut. Left, right, left, knee up and cut. Right, left, right, knee up and cut. Left, right, left, knee up and cut. Right, left, right, knee up and cut. Left, right, left, knee up and cut. Right, left, right, knee up and cut. Left, right, left, knee up and cut. Awesome! Let's skip over to the chicken coop to look for some eggs. Remember, if you ever feel that the activity we're doing is too hard, feel free to walk very slowly or sit down if you really need to. At least two of your daily meals should include protein. Good sources of protein include poultry, like turkey and grilled chicken, seafood, meats, like beef and pork, beans and peas, nuts, and eggs. Since we're now in the chicken coop, let's invent our own chicken and egg dance. Stand with your feet together while flapping your arms like a chicken. Jump slightly forward, then jump back. Now, while making an oval shape like an egg over your head, jump slightly to the right, then jump to the left. Let's try this faster. Ready? Jump forward, jump back, jump right, jump left. And don't forget the arms. Let's do 10 sets. Ready? Forward, back, right, left. Forward, back, right, left. Forward, back, side, side. 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 Forward, back, side, Side, side. Fantastic! Now, let's walk into the barn to see the cows. Cows provide us with milk, and milk is used to make yogurt and cheese. These milk products make up the dairy group. 
You should try to drink or eat two and a half to three cups of dairy products each day since these foods are high in vitamin D, calcium, and potassium. The calcium in milk and other dairy products helps build strong bones and teeth. Keep walking. Did you know that the average cow produces or makes about 100 glasses of milk each day? That's a lot of milk. Let's pretend that we are holding a big bucket of milk in front of us and lift the bucket over your head and pour it into the large tank in front of you. Great! Now we have to get the 100 glasses of milk our cow produced into the tank and each bucket contains 10 glasses of milk. So we'll count by tens as we dump the milk into the tank. Ready? Lift, dump, 10 and down. Lift, dump, 20 and down. Lift, dump, 30 and down. Lift, dump, 40 and down. Lift, dump, 50 and down. Lift, dump, 60 and down. Lift, dump, 70 and down. Lift, dump, 80 and down. Lift, dump, 90 and down. Lift, dump, 100 and down. Excellent work, everyone. Activity work!